Hey everybody, this is Boris uh, coming from Body by Boris in Gainesville, Florida. Uh, today we're talking about the 2015 B3 CrossFit Summer Throwdown. We're going to be doing a series of events talking about all six events and their standards. So today we're going to be doing event number one. It's the first of two auxiliary events that must be done the two weeks prior to the actual event on July 25th. So you have between Monday the 13th and Friday the 24th to get both of these two auxiliary events done. Uh, first one up is the max bench press. So we're going to go over a couple standards and then jump over and see a couple reps with Carly. The prescribed weights for the bench press are 135 for the men, 75 for the women. The scale division is 115 pounds men, 55 pounds women. With uh, with both divisions, you must be uh, you must perform these with a judge. And once the bar is off the rack, you have as much time to get as many reps as you can before you you fail. Uh, once you fail and you rack that bar up, you're done. You only have one opportunity to do this event. Uh, the bar must touch your chest every rep, and you must come fully extended at the top of every rep. Only slight movement in the arch of your back is allowed. You must keep your butt on the bench. Um, you're allowed to rest with your arms extended. You just can't re-rack that weight. Um, and the judge is allowed to help you off of the rack to get you into position. So again, this is event one. It's max reps of the bench press. Go till failure. You only got one shot at this. Um, let's see what the reps look like. All right, so Carly's gonna help us demonstrate uh, some good reps and the standards that we're looking for, as well as what's gonna be a no rep. So first off, bar comes off the rack. Once it's off the rack, she can't rest it back on the rack. She's now going for max reps until failure. So the first standard that we're looking at is gonna be that bar touches the chest every rep. So show them what that looks like. Bar touches the chest, and then she goes to all the way fully extended at the top, elbows extended. So the first thing for no rep would be if the bar doesn't touch her chest. So she's got a little gap there, not quite low enough, that's a no rep. Second one is if it gets to the chest, but she doesn't get fully extended on her elbows before starting the next rep, that's another no rep. All right, so that's event number one. You've got max effort, bench press, get as many reps as you can. Good luck.